What's up everybody, welcome back to my laboratory where safety is number one priority and today I'm gonna show you how to make a mini grill. Let's check this out. Things we're going to need. Easy foil just like that, binder clips, charcoal, lighter, pliers and a knife. Let's get to it. First we're gonna need two of these easy foil. We're gonna put them like that together upside down, match it up. And now we're gonna make holes with the knife. One right here and one right here. Now we're gonna get a binding clip and clip it together from the bottom like this. And second one right here. Now we're gonna grab a third one, put it like that. Now we got a little grill like this. Then you want to grab a coat hanger or a wire and just bend it up like that. So it will fit right here. So whenever you're gonna put your meat, hot dog or something, you can put it right here. Before you're gonna turn it on fire, make sure you make some oxygen coals. One on top, so the smoke can come out. And one right here. So we got oxygen holes, oxygen holes right here. All right, time to test this grill out. First, we're gonna open it and throw a couple pieces of charcoal, just like this. Sometimes it's really hard to turn on the charcoal. Just grab a couple of pieces of Doritos, put it in there. Grab a lighter and just light up the Doritos. The Doritos should burn really easily because they contain a lot of oil. We're gonna give it a minute and wait till the charcoal gets all hot and ready. Make sure do not touch the grill because it gets so hot. Once all the charcoal hot and ready, we're gonna put a hot dog in there. Five minutes later, time to check on a hot dog. Oops, I actually burned it a little. So make sure you don't burn your hot dogs, but that looks perfect to me. Alright guys, that's pretty much it. So next time you want to cook out anywhere you want, just bring your mini grill and cook out pretty much anywhere. In a park, at home, get your grill to go and you don't need a huge truck and huge grill with two people carrying it. Well, thank you for watching. Thumbs up this video. Let me know what you think in the comments below. And as always, see you next time.